Well, this is a perfect shot to start on. <laughs> oh, yeah. The booty cheeks. He's uh, got, like, a wave to them. Like, look at the way he's bouncing his body. He knows how to work it. Yeah, they do. They really do make the, the characters in this game kind of funny. You know how they talk about, like, over-sexualizing characters in video games? <laughs> this is a prime example. <laughs> you think they over-sexualize Fall Guys? They way over-sexualize Fall Guys. Right, I think, ahead. like, in terms of the most over-sexualized characters in video games, <laughs> I'd say it's the Fall Guys guy and then Kirby. <laughs> Oh, Kirby's got buns for days. Kirby's entire body is buns. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. I also weirdly feel like the Fall Guys guy and Kirby are somehow related. That could be. They have the same eyes. They both have, like, you know, well, you know like more when, discernible gender. Well, you know, like, when, um, when you defeat Meta Knight and, like, his face is revealed, he looks like a Kirby. Does he really? Yeah. Like, well, I, I mean, ever isn't it that. assumed that Meta Knight is, like, somewhat of a Kirby? Yeah, he's like a rogue Kirby. Yeah. Like, he just said F you to the other Kirbys. Is there any lore to, like, the universe of Kirby? Oh, there's gotta be. Like, you're gonna tell me that, like, like, Meta, like what, what was Meta Knight? Like, what was his deal? Like, what was, what's DDP's he had, deal? There has to be some story between the Kirby Meta Knight thing. I think like, they were, like, once lovers. And... <laughs> <laughs> um <laughs> no but seriously like what what is a kirby yeah i don't know how did kirby's exist also like what worlds do kirby's live in like, is there a name for it maybe they'll go over all this in yeah. kirby and the forgotten land i needed like a video of the lore behind kirby i remember so like i've never actually played like a kirby game i only know kirby from smash yeah but i remember my friend had a ds game that was like a kirby game and it was really cool yeah i mean they're fun games but have you played them yeah they're like the ds ones you're talking about the 3ds ones no just like uh the regular ds ones this was like way way back because there's like different i don't know there's like so many iterations of the games but basically like there's the regular ones where you just like flop around and like you know suck up enemies and and copy their forms and you get like yeah you, know, you gain their powers mm -hmm. and then you try to defeat the bad guys but then there's like the kirby's canvas curse games where it's like you're you're like stuck in this ball form and then that was like back in the touchscreen days so you would basically okay. draw a line for yourself and that would be the line that you know that makes you progress i don't know it's hard to explain but no i kind of get what you're saying they're interesting games yeah, I don't know which one I saw him play. I just remember there was a lot of fighting, and I thought the fighting was cool. Mm -hmm. But this forward. new Kirby game should be really, really fun. Yeah. But I, I don't know. How do you feel about, like... Because I feel like all these games are trying to be what Breath of the Wild is, like with the open world sort of uh, aspect. What games do you Cause, mean? All right, because if you, if you look at... Kirby in the Forgotten Land, which is the new game coming you out. I don't know what is happening. Right now. Um, I'm gonna go this way if I can. Um, but there's Kirby in the Forgotten Land. There's Sonic Frontiers, which is a new Sonic game coming out. Is it like open world? Yeah. Okay. There's uh, obviously there's Breath of the Wild 2. Okay. And then there's Pokemon Legends Arceus. Wait, I was supposed to grab that, weren't I? <laughs> uh, yeah, but it's all good. It seems like it was hard to grab. Um. You go up that way. Oh, and then yeah. there's Pokemon Legends Arceus. I, oh, crap, there's one more. Like, what are you doing? Just I, go to the I side. You're killing me. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Dude, don't you think I know? I, I'm, I'm lit at this game. You're lit at this game. I'm going to pretend you didn't just say that. <laughs> I feel like at 23, I, I can't say that anymore. <laughs> yeah, you definitely cannot say lit anymore. You, you revo okay. revoked my lit card? Yeah. Alright, bet. 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 All right, moving that on. That will be timeless, though. Oh, Gingy. <laughs> that Look. gingerbread man skin is actually really cool. <laughs> it was funny. I remember in um in college, one of my roommates was like really into gaming, and we had uh, this one friend over, and she was watching him play the game, and uh, he like he changed his skin in the game, and she was like, "Oh, Steve, that's so cute. You changed your game outfit." And he was like, uh, it's not an outfit, it's a skin. And he got uh, so pissed. And we all started calling it an outfit just to fuck with him. <laughs> it was really funny. Well, that's like, 
if somebody who doesn't watch a sport um you know tries to and they're like oh oh like did he just score a touchdown when like they're playing basketball or something? <laughs> yeah <laughs> to be fair though like sports are a little bit more universal where if you yeah, say touchdown true. while watching basketball you got you're really yeah, that's really that's, desensitized that's to way off like I don't watch any sports and I still wouldn't say that you see now I would love that My Godzilla goal. skin that yeah. Godzilla skin is really cool. I want the uh, crocodile skin. I think the crocodile skin is awesome. Yeah, that was cool. But this this one I'm I'm pretty good at. Okay, ready? Oh, oh no! no. <laughs> <laughs> I think you thought that you were about to push him off, and then he pushed you off. No, the the, the problem is I thought I was better at skin. <laughs> I actually was. That's a big problem, actually. You should do this that one. God, I want that Godzilla skin. That's cool. Yeah, it's really cool. I gotta get back into this game. Do you not have this game? No, I do, but um, I haven't played it in a while. Yeah, that's how it is with me. I haven't played it in a long time. I don't know. I just don't like. I obviously I try to play video games, but you know, just work and. and all if these anything, things. I like try not to, but I just love them too much to stay away. I know. Because like thing. between like music and work and stuff, like there's always something that I could be doing at home that's somewhat more productive than playing a video game. But they're just fun. Like to me. Me doing this is like other people watching TV, so like who really cares? Yeah, it's a good point. But, but yeah, I mean, even like with the productivity argument, like, I don't know, like when you're when you're playing a game, like, yeah, like games are meant to be like a form of like escapism. Yeah. So I'm not like obviously like after I play a game for like two or three hours, I'm like, damn, I should probably do something. But it's also like I feel like there's this weird stigma to games where like it's like. I don't know people are always like oh you shouldn't spend your day playing video games because like you're not doing anything with yourself but like other people can spend their entire day watching movies and like that's not as frowned upon as spending your entire day playing a game exactly and in a lot of ways this is like a lot more mentally stimulating than sitting there watching you mm -hmm. know the full batman trilogy yeah not trilogy i don't know it's not a trilogy but all the batman movies yeah but um <laughs> how's your <laughs> How's your internal clock doing? My internal clock is on point. I'm saying not after this. Like, once we finish this, I think it's going to be at 10 minutes. Okay. So, for those of you who don't know, Bandicam, which is a program we downloaded today, <laughs> mind you, um, only has a 10 minute timer. So, we're, we're trying to keep this going until, you know, the 10 minute timer runs out. But we keep forgetting to set a phone timer. Yeah. We forgot to do it last time, and then this time we just completely blanked yet again. Also, oh, it looks cool. really fun to swing on that rope, so please swing on that rope. Alright, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try. Well, they're all doing it in unison. Like, how do I... Get it! Come on! How do you do this? That's impossible. Get it, get it, get it, get it! Hold on, hold on. I got it, I got it. Am I supposed to grab onto it? Yeah, you have to grab it. Oh, here we go, yes. here we go. Oh, we go. that was so cool. Now that is what we call clean. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty clean, I can lie. Got me going a little bit. Dude, I'm telling you, I'm good at this game when I actually, like, you know. Stop trying to go over the center. You did that last time, too. Alright. Let's do this. Ooh. Ah, clean. <laughs> this thing's a clean. That was some beautiful gameplay right there. That? Those things had a weird, funny face. What had a weird, funny face? Like the things that suck you down. Oh yeah, they did have a weird, funny face. But you're telling me these are real people? Yeah, I know. It's kind of crazy that it's everyone's playing the same game at the same time. It's, it's a lot. Because I know, like in Fortnite, they just like, I don't know, when the game started dying down, they started adding bots and everything. Oh, did they really? Yeah, I mean, apparently. I don't know if it's uh, changed now. I really hope they don't add bots to this game. That would kind of take the fun out of it for me. I know. Just, like, knowing that they're bots. Yeah. I feel like it's fun because it's, like, you think that you're playing against all these real people. Yeah, because, you know like, I, mean? I mean, half the game is, like, you know, when if somebody tries to, like, grab you and throw you off, like, that's, yeah, it's funny. It's yeah, like, it's hey, funny, like, seeing people bitch. mess with you in the game and, like, messing with them and stuff. Exactly. I don't know. Oh, grab a tail. Oh, I have a tail. Ooh. All right, Mike. If you keep the tail for the entire time, I'll be extremely